friends, hey family, como estas? Bienvenidos. It's your girl, Melissa Q, back with another video, and we are back with Main Mondays. Now, in today's video, we are going to go through our natural hair empties. I'm going to give you some mini reviews of the items. I did do full reviews of some of these products, but without further ado, let's get into the video. We are making it show and sweet. This is the Tresemme Naturals Radiant Volume Conditioner. This is infused with natural ingredients like sweet, orange, and lemongrass. I love this. I've talked about this. I got this from Big Lots. Whenever you see Tresemme Naturals, pick it up. This is a great detangler if you have children. This is amazing. You're not going to spend a lot of money, but this is an amazing detangler that actually detangles like a salon product. And I also use this as a leave-in. It's very, very moisturizing. If you have fine, thin hair, it is like lightweight as well. You just don't use a lot of it, but it's super moisturizing. I highly recommend it. I would repurchase it. I have another one in my shower. This is a product that I regret buying. This, I ranked my co-washes. This probably was the worst because in price and it did not do what it said it was going to do. This is the Madam CJ Walker Hella Hydration Drenched Hydration Cream Co-Wash. No ma'am. No ma'am. It's definitely a product that I regret buying. Do not like it. Don't get it save your money i don't even think that i saw this at um sephora anymore they may have taken it off but i didn't like this it is the the whip by smooth naturals one of my favorite twist out products this one is an almond i do have some more in almond rum i try to keep this at the ready so good i've talked about this in the past it's an old 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 review of this but still does this amazing thing super moisturizing you can use this as a leave-in or as a styler so i really enjoyed this would repurchase did done do just all the present past and future this is the bikura beauty cacao bark deep conditioning hair treat and the yam ne nectar y'all these right here i really missed i missed so I went through these in 2019. I really love these products and I will repurchase these. These were so good. And it's like when you want to have a spa at home, you want to treat yourself. In 2020, I probably won't be purchasing this just because I want to save a little bit of money. But I definitely believe in the salon at home experience. I just, um, I think I want to save some money because these are on the pricier side in terms of hair care products. But the cacao bark and the yam nectar together, girl. Magic. Um, I have um I already have and opened the this one. This is the Mayel Mint Almond Oil. It promotes healthy hair and scalp. It is so good. I would repurchase it. I already have one, and I love it. This is from Bikura Beauty. It's just um I don't even know if they per they make this anymore. This is the Java Bean and Honey. I won't repurchase this just because I think honey is a humectant that causes my hair to frizz up. I only like to use it when I'm deep conditioning. So I would not repurchase this. It's something about rinsing out the product that my hair is okay with. And then when I seal with cold water. So I know some of you guys have talked about that. And we'll talk about that in this upcoming year. Because a lot of my videos will be hair care prone. So look out for that. This was one of the worst deep conditioners that I have ever purchased. This is the Fruit Infusion Coconut Water Weightless Hair Mask by... Shea Moisture, probably the worst one that they've made in my opinion. It did not do anything. As a matter of fact, I felt like it tangled my hair even more. And usually deep conditioners do the opposite for my hair. I didn't like it. I thought it was going to do something just because it says it's for fine to medium hair, which I have. It didn't do none, girl. This is the Melt Into Moisture by Diva Curl. This is the total opposite. This is one of the best deep conditioners that I feel like any curly girl could ever purchase this is so 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 good i love it so much i think diva curl needs to come out with more deep conditioners girl why you don't have like five or six of them seven or eight but this is amazing um this is their most recent i want to say deep conditioner i love it repurchase already got one when you know you have a deep conditioner and it makes you think about before you run out the other one about getting one that's the deep conditioner you get i'm just saying this is the Aloe Whipped Butter Gel. Not my favorite by Camille Rose. I love their Almond Jai Twist Butter way better. Even though it's a bit heavier, this one, I must have didn't like it because I didn't finish all of it. Um, it was okay. I would use this as a light 
leave-in. I would not use this as a twist out. It was okay. And I put this in a project pan. And usually when I love something, I don't put hair products in a project pan if I really don't love it. And mm, I could do without it. This is the Moroccan oil. This is the moisture repair shampoo. I really like this. I surprisingly, I really, really enjoyed this and it left my hair clean this is great for color treated hair and it's sulfate free so if you want something that's gonna foam really well it smells great you can pick this up from sephora i feel like it's a really great buy this is the Rizarco reparative leave-in conditioning spray i really like this by briogeo and i have some more of these i do have the larger one i would repurchase this this is avocado oil you can just get some it is amazing make your own mix I should keep this sprayer mm. but I'm not gonna keep it just because I have some already I, this is a great one to mix with like the almond mint if you want something a little bit more viscous um, you can put some other oils in there I have a little bit in there mm. y'all oh yes but that was good I would repurchase it um, another non hair product in here this is pumpkin donut by one of my favorite brands, DW Home. Y'all, while you do your hair, light a candle. It is amazing. I would repurchase that. I don't know why that's in there. The final product is by Epiphany Scents. She's currently closed her store, but she still does this. This is butternut, co butternut cookie dough body frosting, but I use it in my hair. Amazing. I believe I have another one and this was so good. The scent is intoxicating. Loved it so much. Those are my natural hair empties. I hope you guys found this helpful. These little reviews. Hope you find it. Especially if you're high porosity. Girl, get you some or don't get it at all. I'm just saying. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button before you leave. And the notification bell because it's going to let you know every Monday. We come in with May Monday. And then we do have other hair care and hair care related videos throughout the week. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.